Previously on Real Chance of Love. Y'all are beautiful. Y'all are fucking get up for yourself. Damn, we got some fine ladies, man. Bad to the bone. I thought first season they were fine, but this season takes the cake. What made you come to the show? I'm here for you. For me? I done lost somebody like that. We spent the past 10 weeks looking for love again. And man, it hasn't gotten any easier. I want to like, get to know you personally and spend time with you. It seems like you're serious about finding love. I dig that. <laughs> Don't scratch this Bentley. Man, when you put this many fine ladies under one roof, there's bound to be some trouble. I just want to move out of this no. And we sure as hell found it. Are you here to find a good man, or are you just here just because you just want to be on TV? All the above. No, I'm kidding. You know what? It might have been a crazy journey, but in the end, I got to know a couple ladies that just might be the real deal. You know, I like you, man, because you keep it real with your boy. Oh, Lord. I've heard you say you are looking for a certain type of woman. So I see, I feel like you could be that woman. Come get this chain. Girls have no idea with me and Real have going on. He is loving some of her. Yeah, we have a romantic thing going on, but we also could be buddies. You're so wonderful. You gave me like the best day I ever had. I like you a lot. I want to know if you're a good kisser. I guess she just gave me my answer. Love ain't nothing without a spark, but there was straight up fireworks along the way when I was trying to find my stallion there. I mean, you know, let me piss off the side of this cliff. Oh man, like what's going on? Is it the liquor? We're gonna have to leave. For you, from the Sorry, bro. You're crazy, man. Thank you, real. I'm really trying to teach Chance a lesson right now. What would you do if I was to get Chance tattooed on me? I think you should go back on my brother's side because I see he makes you happy. I'm just glad to have you back, babe. Are you my daddy? If you let me, that you won't be. What? Man, I ain't never known nobody that can't take a joke. Look at it. Once you get that time with him, it's going to be over. I'm not a quitter. I need to stay here and compete. Ooh. If I can't accept your funk, we must not be meant to be. Me and Jess just compliment each other. As far as Pocahontas, she's trying to hide something else. Is there anything that you've done in the past that you reflect is going to come back and bite you in your ass? Well, when I was younger in high school, I was dating this guy, and then I ended up dating his best friend. You had a threesome? That's not me. I think it's fine. I do have questions about both of you women. And I just feel like the only way for me to get my answers, man, is for me to take all three of you to Miami with me. torn between Sassy and Polka at this point, and he makes the decision to keep both of them. Oh. Ugh. What's so good about them that's making him get so tripped up inside? Thank you, ladies. I'm upset that Pocahontas is still here. I see through her What are you hiding? I have to find out what it is. There's no time to waste. All right, ladies. Good night. Good night. It's been such a crazy ride. Now, it's just me and Hot Wings competing for Chance. You have everything? Mm-hmm. I don't know how well Hot Wings and Chance get along, but I know that the chemistry Chance and I have going on is just amazing. And I'm pretty sure that that crybaby won't break it up. Going to Miami. Bye, Yeti! <laughs> Last night, Baker went home, and now I'm in the final two? Are you kidding me? Since day one, I've been through so many ups and downs, and I'm just so ready to say sayonara. Hey, girls, are you ready to go to Miami? Yeah. Well, let's do this! I'm totally excited to go to Miami, but you know, it's kind of a buzzkill because Sassy's going too. But at the same time, I feel really confident that Real feels that I'm truly here for him and that we have that connection. I have nothing to worry about. I 
gotta take a piss. She did a hip hop move right there. <laughs> well, they're going to town now. So we get to the Sagamore Hotel and I see some congueros with three professional dancers. Go, 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 And we're in South Beach and I get all excited. I'm like the only one screaming like, oh my God, South Beach, Ladies, just come with me and I'll take you up to your penthouse suites. Oh, yeah. Ladies, we have a dinner tonight. We shall see you a little later, all right? All right. Fact of the matter is, man, I got three girls, but I only got room for two. So I arranged a beautiful dinner for my lady tonight. There's some things that are on my mind that I need to know. But as for me, I'm laying low tonight. Tomorrow, you know, I still got mama sitting in hot ones going neck to neck. And you know what? I will find my stallion there. Is this your penthouse? Yeah! yeah. and it's amazing. Oh my God, beautiful view. You can see the ocean. I loved it. Oh my God, this is amazing. People, where's the naked people at? Is that what you're wearing? Yep, that's my whole outfit. Oh, you're gonna get it tonight. No, oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm feeling kind of like nervous because I haven't had a date with Phil in a while and I really, really need to step it up. Do I look like a fat pig? Baby, you're already pretty. Out of the three, I don't think Sassy deserves to be here. I just don't think that he has a connection with her. I don't see it. Hello, ladies. Thank you for joining me for dinner. Hi, Hanson. Mm. How are you? Okay. Lady in red. I'm so happy. I'm here. I'm in the top three right now, and so that means that he sees something, that he really likes me, and I'm not gonna let this go. Wowzer. <laughs> this is the best looking red snapper I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> well, I'm glad to have you ladies here. I'm glad to be here. Out of all the girls that came here, I feel like you three are the ones that were mostly here for me. Genuinely. I mean, the fact of the matter is, man, I couldn't make up my mind. I couldn't let go of Polka, Doll, or Sassy. I needed to bring them here to Miami to make my final decision. I only got dates prepared here for two women. Tomorrow, man, it really starts, and tomorrow I'm going to have to make a big decision who's going to spend, which two ladies are going to spend the rest of the time with me here in Miami. I will let you ladies know tomorrow morning which two I will be taking with me. Real tells us at dinner that someone's gonna be eliminated tomorrow. Like I told y'all, I don't wanna make no damn mistakes. And 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 I feel like I needed to do what I needed to do. I mean, it's a no-brainer. You keep Doll and myself, and you eliminate Sassy. The last girl I dated, I didn't know she was engaged previously. Like a month before she came to the show, she just broke off the engagement. Oh, wow. When I pick that right woman, I just want to know who that woman is. But you know, the fact of the matter, I really don't know that much about y'all. So I asked the producers for your audition tapes. And I asked the producers for your applications. So I bust out the cast of tapes on the girls, man, because I want to see how the girls were before they came to the show, to make sure they just ain't fronting in front of my face. I actually would like to take a look at them right now. I have nothing to hide, really. I really don't. I've told them pretty much everything. I just, I just haven't gone into great detail. I did all this because I needed to know the truth. I needed to see this stuff for myself. Coming up. I just don't like the chance. You're fly, you're sexy. I love your swagger. Sounds to me like you have a chance. She may just be too young, man, and not know what she wants, and we may not be at the same place in life. That concerns me a little bit. And later. There was questions that I needed to know about all of you. Last night, I got the answers that I was looking for. Man, I thought all the other eliminations was hard. This is going to be the hardest one. I really want to believe you. I really do. I did all this because I needed to know the truth. I may have three girls here in Miami, but the fact of the matter is, I only got dates for two. I needed to see this stuff for myself. So your boy, bam! I bust out casting tapes on the girls. 
I gotta get down to business tonight. Honestly, I look good on camera. <laughs> you ain't gotta be conceited. I'm not. What brought you here today is real as a chance. Real. Huh. Why real? He's so dreamy. <laughs> He's so dreamy. Am I arrogant? I'm confident. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so weird. Like I'm trying to get where I'm going. I'm not gonna step on you, but I might step on your toes a little bit. The one thing that I did look at was your <laughs> apps. It wasn't much a highlight. Do you have any tattoos that you put? You do not put a bumper sticker on it. <laughs> and I have a little OCD, like things very neat and organized. I know you was high maintenance from jump. I'm you know not. what I'm saying? You know what I mean? OCD. You know what? I, one thing I will say about you, though, man, after watching that tape and, 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 and reading this, hell, you're the same damn person. Sassy was the same person in her video and um, in person. Doesn't mean she's a good person. I like to look I'm good for you. I'm not about to you. bash you. Mm -hmm. Like, yes, Sassy, go, Sassy. My confidence is through the roof right now. Let me move on. Beautiful little polka. Let's see if you're too good to be true. <laughs> <laughs> I know that I've shown 99% of who I am. But I'm thinking, God, what did I say? What did I put down? I was dating this one guy, and um, he asked me what his what my fantasy was, and my fantasy was to to f his best friend, and he was got on the phone, called his best friend. His friend was at the drive-through. It was like gotta go, and came through. Did you have sex with both of them? Yes. I was 22. It happened. When I asked you yesterday, did you do something with both of them? You were like, no, absolutely not. You never not. asked me that. Yes, I did. Who had a threesome? That's not me. I think he's fair. Um, maybe you didn't hear me, but you sure answered the question. kind of shocked me. I know you're a woman that loved God. My heart like dropped. I just, I had this nasty feeling. I looked into Real's eyes and I was just like, who are you? Like, why are you attacking me like this? All right, all right, I'm, I'm going to the next one. The truth is that the video was about my past. I'm so angry. I'm so angry that he would even go there. Doll. I'm gonna tell you right now, off the bat. I don't wanna know nothing, I just wanna see this. I know off the bat that when Real sees this video, there's gonna be a problem because I've been Real the whole time, but my video may not seem like that's what I was here for, you know? I want a guy that's gonna be like amped. I definitely love somebody with swagger. I like the dudes that have the wave caps, the hats, the pants, the chains. I like that, it's my turn on. I just definitely think chance, you're fly, you're sexy. I love you, Swagger. I don't want a guy that's like boring because it's just not gonna work. Sounds to me like you was here for chance. First poking now, dog. Now I don't, I don't even know. Now I don't think dog even knows what she wants, man. At first, I kind of thought that we would be maybe. I don't sound like the guy that you said you like in there. Yeah, but that's more because I was aimed towards your brother. What made you change your mind so swift? Because you're more like me. You're more laid back, you're more emotional, you're more compassionate. I haven't heard girls say that before. They want to be with the wild party guy. You ain't never heard a nice guy because that ain't who they really want to be with. They want to be with the wild guy. That concerns me a little bit. I ain't that guy that she described in her tape. By listening to all this, it got me really kind of thinking, man, that she may just be too young, man, and not know what she wants, and we may not be at the same place in life. I did all this because I needed to know the truth. I brought all three of you here because I needed to find out which two ladies were going to spend the rest of the time with me here. I appreciate you for answering the questions, whether you liked them or not. But the fact of the matter is, I will let you ladies know tomorrow morning which two I will be taking with me throughout the rest of my days here in Miami. 
Rail tells us, you know what? One of you girls have to go home, and now my stomach is in knots. <sighs> How embarrassing. Oh, God, I would die if he sent me home. It would devastate me. It really would. This morning, Rail really threw me off with those videos. I mean, I have knots and butterflies in my stomach. I am so sad and disappointed in myself because I really, really like this guy and I feel like I hurt his feelings. It's tough because I know that we have eliminations this morning. I hope it's like jet skiing or we're probably gonna go on a boat. I would be devastated if I was eliminated. I'm really here for him and I know he knows this deep down inside. I'm not even hungry. I'm just hoping that our connection is gonna be stronger than concerns about my negative past. Good morning, ladies. You look really good and really refreshed. Today, two of you ladies are gonna set sail with me and my brother on this beautiful yacht right here. And tomorrow, two of you will be joining me and my brother on an adventure that I guarantee you, you will never, ever forget. All right, look, so Mama Sita, me and you are gonna set the high seas for a beautiful cruise. Yes. But look, 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 look. Hot wings, tomorrow me and you going on a wild <laughs> adventure. Mama Sita, come on, girl. Let's go jump on a yacht. Oh, my God. I totally want to be on this date. All these beautiful yachts. Bye, Hot Wings. Hi, ladies. So, Chance picks Mama Sita to go on the date. You know, this sucks right now, but I know I'll get my date later. Good luck on your decision. Thank you. Oh, man. I thought all the other eliminations was hard. This is gonna be the hardest one. Ladies, as I told you last night, the reason why I brought all of you out here, there was questions that I needed to know about all of you. And I believe last night I got the answers that I was looking for. Sassy, I mean, it's so good to see that you're the person standing before me that you're on that audition tape, which shows me that you've been keeping it real with me the whole time. So Sassy, will you join me tomorrow for one untamed date? Okay. You can go back with Hot Wings to the hotel, and I'll catch up with you later, all right? I'm a little disappointed I'm not going on a date today, but I am ecstatic that I'm not going home either. I'm definitely feeling like Pocahontas is going home, and it's about time. <sighs> so this leaves me with you, Polka, and you, doll. Two beautiful, gorgeous women that I really, really connected with on a lot of different levels. Doll, when I sat back and I watched that, watched that audition tape, it sounded to me like you were, you know, you were asking for more of a bad boy type of guy, somebody more like my brother, somebody that I'm not. I'm afraid that I'm gonna end up falling in love with you and you're gonna end up hurting me in the end. I just have butterflies in my stomach and I don't want him to have the wrong idea. I really am here for him and I really like him a lot and I just hope he sees that. Then, Poker, when I asked you, did you have a threesome or foursome with him and his boy, you told me no. And then I watched the dog on tape and you sit up there and you're saying that you had a threesome with him and his boy? Here he is, not trusting me and trusting what we have. And it just sucks because I'm really here for him. And I know he knows this deep down inside. I know he does. It got me started thinking like, who the, like, maybe I don't know who you are. Coming up. I feel a spiritual connection with you. I feel the same way. I definitely want to take this further. Hi. And later. So what do you do when things get rough in a relationship? I'm feisty. He just needs to know that this is what he's been searching for. I did see you frown. You challenged me. At least you know that side of me. I gotta do something I don't wanna do, man. I gotta let one of my girls go. And I got an incredible connection with both of these women, man. But you know what? I gotta make a decision. Doll, when I sat back and I watched that, watched that audition tape, it sounded to me like you were, you know, you were asking for more of a bad boy type of guy, somebody more like my brother, somebody that I'm not. 
then Poker, when I asked you, did you have a threesome or foursome with him and his boy, you told me no. Maybe I don't know who you are. You know what, I really want to believe you. I really do. But I don't, I don't know, I'm a little scared and I don't know if I'm ready to take that chance. So, doll, will you come get on the boat with me? And I gotta let you go, Poker Man, because I feel like you lied to me, man. And this whole thing in the relationship is about trust and honesty. And I just don't feel like you was honest with me, man. I'm really upset because I had true feelings for real. I felt as though he did also. I wish that I would have had a little bit more like one-on-one -on -one time to really explain what he was saying. <laughs> I mean, everyone has a past. Everyone has skeletons in their closet. It doesn't mean you're proud of it. <sighs> How embarrassing. <laughs> Before me and Miss Hot Wings pull off in the limo, we see Pocahontas walking down the dock, bawling like a freaking baby. <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen. I knew he was gonna send you home. The witch is dead. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Real decides to send Poker home. Yeah. And brings me on the yacht. I'm so excited right now. I have tears in my eyes. Were you scared up there? Did you think? What did you, what did you think? What was going I on in your head? My stomach was in such knots. I just didn't want you to think the wrong thing because when I did the tape, it was for that, and that's why I said what I said. But at the end of the day, I mean, like seriously, we've connected so good in just a short period of time. I need love in my life, that I need a man that's really gonna love me and be there for me, and that's exactly why I'm here. That's why I'm here for real. I'm here to find love with him, because he's that person. If I liked bad boys, then me and him would have never connected the way that we did. You're full of energy, and you have all this religious belief. Seriously, the way we've bonded in just a short period of time, like, I never open up to anybody. Nobody knows anything about me. Even though Doll said in her audition that her type is more of my brother's type, I feel that the connection that me and her have is a strong bond, and I think, hey, Maybe I'm the guy that she's really been looking for this whole time. I want to see my girl share some tears so I can comfort her. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? <laughs> Come here. Oh, oh my god, this yacht is so beautiful. And it's huge. Wind is hitting our faces. I feel like a million dollars. <laughs> Ladies, you guys want to join me and my brother? We about to go get on some uh, jet skis. Yeah. Me and my brother love water sports, especially when we got some fine girls with us. Hey, it's on. Be safe out there. Mama Cita, watch your chin. No freaking way. This is going to be so fun. My hair is blowing in the wind, his hair is blowing in the wind. We're looking like we're in a music video. How can they look better than me? Come on, just step on it. What the hell is going on? You are flying over there, bro. How are you doing that? Oh, wow. what about this stuff to the boat? You know, I'd be going a lot faster on this damn jet ski, man, if I didn't have Mama see these big knockers and her big butt on the back of this sucker, man. Ladies first. Right now, I'm having one of the best dates with the ocean breeze on her face, and everything is just like a dream. Thank you. Hey, guys. Can we borrow your ski dude? <laughs> Yeah, right. I'm having a great time with Mama Sita. Mama Sita, you're fun, you're beautiful, you're always a blast. <laughs> oh, manatee. <laughs> you did not see Oh, no, that's just some brown seaweed. <laughs> you know, our first day went awesome, man. Mama Sita showed me such a wonderful time, you know, and I had a great connection with her. Thank you so much. My date with Dawg was amazing, man. I mean, we had fun. We had a hell of a day. Me and my brother gonna head back to the hotel, and I will see you later, all right? Mm.
Bye. So tonight we're playing a beautiful dinner with Mama Sita and Doc. lot of time with Chance lately. She's spent the night with them before, she's gone on plenty of dates, and I'm just a little worried. How'd it go? Mm, it went cool, you know. Oh, stop it. <laughs> no, we did have a, like, a little, like... You came back happy. I heard you crazy. <laughs> I'm just jealous. Tonight will define if we stay here or not. I know tonight's the last time I see Chance before elimination. After tonight, if we act retarded, if we act cute, if we... Like, that's gonna, like, depend on, like, whether we stay or not. I just hope that tonight Chance realizes that I've been nothing but real and genuine and that that actually helps me win his heart tonight. I'm so looking forward to dinner tonight with Rail. I think it's gonna be more serious because, you know, he knows me on that playful, sensual level, but I think he really wants to get down and ask me questions. He wants to make sure I'm the right one. Bye, girls. Welcome to the Riviera South Beach Resort. This is the ladies' last chance to connect with your boys, and this is your boys' last chance to connect with the... With the ladies. So you know what? Tonight we're gonna have a beautiful romantic dinner that they'll never, I mean, ever. ever forget. How nice is this? Sit down, my love. Yay, thank you. Ooh. Uh-huh. Oh. <gasps> Ooh, blue clicker. Or blue clicker. I forgot. <laughs> Did you have a good time today, sweetie? Oh my god, it was such a great time. What's our age different? Six. I'll be honest with you, when I see you, I don't really look at age. Yeah, I don't either. I never but look at age. You are your age. I am young and in shape and healthy. I'm full of life. And experienced. In certain things. Does it seem like that? Sometimes. What do you mean sometimes it does? I really like Daw, man. I really dig it. But at this point in the game, man, I'm really concerned about Daw, her age, and how, and if she really knows what she wants, man. Listen, I'm ready to get married. That's the type of girl I am. You ready to get married at 23 years old? Yeah. Like, if you're going to be in a relationship with somebody that you really care about and you're in love with them anyway, seen with them all the time, why not just get married and make it something that's permanent? You know, a lot of people in this world, man, say that they're ready to settle down. But in real life, they're not ready to settle down. And they don't realize it until they got into that relationship and somebody ended up getting hurt. I mean, man, I've been on this love journey for quite some time. Mm -hmm. I'm very damn serious. I know. I see that, and I like that a lot. Do you want me to have bare boobs? Let me see how big you can make them. They get, like, so retarded. She entertains the living hell out of him. I mean, look at this. Hey, bruh. She's like Pinocchio, her boobs grow. Pinocchio, how does your breast get too long? Magic. You know what, I'm really feeling Mama Sita right now, man. This is my type of woman. Are you ready for a relationship? I just want a real man that can make me laugh, that I can have a good time with, a good time with. I was just about to say, I just don't hope you're not, I'll be at home tonight while you're out partying. I hate that, you know? But I don't say I like drinking crazy and being a maniac like it happened at your mansion. I want Chance to know that I'm not just a party girl. I can stay home and be a serious girlfriend. What else can you do? You gonna be supportive if you was my girlfriend? If you were to get injured or whatever, like, yeah, I would, like, I would stand up and I wouldn't be like, What if oh, I was in a I'm wheelchair? Sorry, you, would you leave me? Never. Never. How would that change? It, it would be a tragedy in the relationship, yes. But how would that change anything between that person if it's a soul connection? It shouldn't, and it and well, it wouldn't. That's a damn good me. woman that can stay with a guy. God, that's some good man. This day with Mama Sita tonight, man. I'm starting to feel Mama Sita has everything I'm really looking for in a woman, man. Nice body, nice personality. You know what I mean? Great sense of humor. That would actually be kind of fun. Like I can push you around everywhere in your. <laughs> <laughs> I have one more question for you. This is a serious one. OK. okay. Will you kiss me? Aww. Man, you know what? I'm really feeling doll, man. There's a possibility, man, that she could maybe be Mrs. Real. 
I definitely feel a connection with you. I feel a spiritual connection with you, because I, 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 I don't just hook up with people and have a great time with them. And I get along with you great. I feel the same way. I, I truly do. Mm -hmm. Mama Sita, wow. You really impressed me tonight, and I'd like to take you back to my room for a night tap. Night tap or cap? I mean, night cap. <laughs> me in flowers? <gasps> so nice! <laughs> it does something to me. I love them. How sexy is that? Don't stop. That can be a thing. It's real? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Freaking thumb and foot hurting. Say what? I got this. Pull the shoe. <gasps> You're so sexy. You know that? You're so... I mean... Oh my god. I definitely want to take this further. I want to go from the living room to the bedroom. Hi. Oh my god. Coming up. Come on! No! Hell no! Did you see that? I win, you better not! Uh, and later. Are you holding back a little bit on me? What do you mean? I want a woman that knows that her man loves her. I felt like you had a stronger connection with some of the other girls, and that had me kind of doubting how strong our connection was. It's the morning, and I'm feeling like me and Rail's connection has been strengthened so much more. The rose petals, the champagne, the kissing was just exactly what I wanted, and it was exactly what I got. Oh my god, my makeup is smeared, my hair is all messed up, but it was completely worth it. Like, I'm happy that I had an amazing date with Chance. I wish I could do it again. Hi, doll. Good morning. I'm so happy right now. I don't even know, like, what to say. True love stands the test of time, logic, and all circumstances. I like like that, but I'm a girl, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely really excited today to get to spend some alone time with Real. Do you see yourself in a long-term relationship with me, wife, kids, all of that? I took some time over the last few days to write down some questions for him. I really need some answers because sometimes with the way he acts and the things that he says, I doubt if he's really feeling me. I'm confident. I want to go all smiles and giddiness. <laughs> I have no clue what we're going to be doing, but I know whatever it is is going to be something glamorous. I am just so ready to enjoy this and have a good time. Oh, Gator Park. Ah, Gator Park! I don't know why the hell you would take Sassy on a damn alligator crocodile date instead of a yacht. The only gator I've ever seen was shoe store in Detroit. You ready to go hunt for some giant alligators? Some 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 flying scorpions? So we arranged for an airboat to take us around the swamps, man, so we can spot some crazy gators, man. You know, I hope our girls can get down and dirty, man. Because they are some girly girls, if you know what I mean. Let's go jump on the airboat and let's go look for some gators. Time to go gator hunting, boy. The, the Loch Ness swamps of the Everglades. <laughs> at a gator park and the other girls got to go on a yacht, but I gotta make the best of this opportunity right now. So my mission today is just to really show Chance my adventurous side. Wow. So are there gators in these shallow waters? Actually, out this way, you may see them every once in a while. Oh, what is that? Oh. You can... oh. Man, it's... Did you it's see that? It's fun. <laughs> Hey, man! When an alligator 
get scared as a defense mechanism. They can jump two thirds of their body length straight out of the water. Anything else around usually gets pretty scared seeing that big reptile up in the air like that. Here, I don't know about this anymore. Man, there's games yeah. over here. Right, right, left. I mean, it's nutty out there, man. Real, left. What's under these waters? Any baby gators? Yeah. There's everything out here, but you can see them coming. The water's shallow enough, they won't be able to sneak up on you. Mama Zita's beautiful. She's fun. And she's got this wild side that I think Chance really likes, but I have to find a way to outshine her. So I'm like, you know what, Chance? I'll show you that I'm adventurous and I have balls. I win. You better not! But leave her alone. Let her be one with me. Oh, my God. You What is that? Is that a snake? What is that? Uh, <laughs> no, I'm, just kidding. Oh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Come on. So how we dares for me to get in that damn water? All right, man, I see this girl's a real trooper, lumberjack, Dundee type of individual. But oh, guess yeah. what? Hey, guess what? Whoa! Shoot! Man, I'm just a simple boat rider, man. <laughs> I ain't no swamp man. Go ahead! No! No, 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 no! You are dealing with a city slicker. You know how much that you proved to me? And I'm not no scaredy cat. Sure ain't. That made her sexy in a whole new life. Girl, you look good. She loves Lurking her man. Lurking in waters. She loves her man. So you guys have a good time? Yes, we yeah. did. The Gator Park was amazing. It's an experience that I will never forget. Tonight is our last night with these ladies, man. We just need to spend some time with these ladies because we have a very, very important and hard decision we have to make. date and I'm just thinking this is probably gonna be your last date with him so you really need to step it up because I have to show him you need me in your life and I'm the one you need to pick right now I feel like I've shown real a little bit of everything I have to offer I feel like tonight at dinner this is my time to amplify all of that that's is gonna bring the romance. Welcome, ladies, welcome. Wow, you ladies look stunning this evening. Wow, you look beautiful. Are you ready for a romantic dinner with the stallion there? Yeah. Yes. When I saw Sassy Mae, that woman was smoking. Man, Ooh. I'm very, very, very excited about tonight's dinner, man, because this is my time to get to know Sassy on a more deeper level. It looks so beautiful to see. And it's time for me to see how Wink's real side. You know, that maturity, that immaturity is uh, killing me a little bit. It's time for her to, I want to see a serious side. I want to see that grown woman within. Welcome to Grass. We have a great evening planned out for you. Oh, OK, OK, OK. I like Grass. Right this way, guys. This is nice. Nice place, huh? Yeah, it is. I see a future with a woman like you. Cause you're my type. I see a feature of a man like you. Oh, that was, twin. I just spit out my mouth. That tastes like grass. <laughs> Chance is just a big jokester. He loves joking around. He's always clowning out, and I love it. I love that part about him. He's the type that knows how to lighten up and have a good time. You know I'm happy when I'm around you. Are you? I'm just not happy when I see you wondering and thinking all hard. I show right. everything I feel. I know. I noticed that. And it really pours out of your eyes. So what do you do when things get rough in a relationship? I don't run when things get rough in a relationship. I fight it out. How do you deal with fighting? I, yeah, you I are fighting. Look, I'm feisty. I'm feisty. I did see you fair, and you challenged me. Like, At least you know that side of me. OK, all right. Chance may be worried that I'm going to blow up on him again, but he just needs to know that I'm the right one. But I've seen your temper flare before, and that show ain't pretty. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't like hiding how I feel, though. Me and you, <laughs> the moon, and a little bit of this. We're sitting down eating dinner, and it's very romantic. 
I'm like a little schoolgirl with a big old crush on an older boy or something. You can probably already tell I'm not a fully submissive woman. Oh, you think you know how to handle me? I definitely think I can handle you. What makes you so sure? I can tell that you like a strong woman who's able to hold her own. Are you holding back a little bit on me? What do you mean? I mean, I just feel like you've been a little guarded and a little bit distant at times. But I think some of it also had to do with the fact that you weren't as aggressive as you could have been at times. Honestly, I came here feeling like it was just going to happen. And then as things went on, I did kind of start to doubt. Why? Because I felt like you had a stronger connection with some of the other girls. And that had me kind of doubting, you know, how strong our connection was. I mean, shoot, man, you're freaking beautiful and sexy as hell. I was waiting for those signs. I feel like real is taking my lack of aggression as meaning that I'm not interested in him, and it's not true. OK, I got two questions. <clears throat> I'm prepared for all the questions you have for me. How many questions? So check this out, man. What, bruh? Sassy pulls out a list of questions for your boy. What? Put your boy on the spot. Interrogation room. Interrogation. I wrote down some things that I wanted to say to you also. She's scared yeah, the hell out of me. I don't like this, man. She got the raise. I mean, damn, you, you know, you kind of scared me now. You got a whole damn notebook. Damn! Coming up. Do you feel I meet your requirements? As of right now, could you see yourself in a long-term relationship with me? Well, she put me on the spot a little bit. And later. There's thunder and lightning, and that's exactly how my heart is feeling right now. <clears throat> OK, I got a question. I wrote down some things that I wanted to say to you also. I, I took some time over the last few days to write down some questions for him. I'm prepared for all the questions you have for me. Could you see yourself in a long-term relationship with me? And I mean, wife, kids, everything? Very, 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 very possible. Very damn possible. Do you feel as though I meet your requirements? Do you actually think I would be spending my time with you if I didn't feel like you, you met those requirements? <laughs> What's a brother going to get if, if you end up being my woman? I would walk on water and through a mountain. She put me on the spot a little bit. But you know what, man? I'm not even tripping. Because, because to be honest with you, man, I'm glad she has some questions to ask me. I'm sh glad she's showing me some interest. Would you come back to the crib for some dessert? That, I, I, some I, champagne. I would love to. You know why you're still around? Why? Because I saw that fire in you. You're emotional, but that's good, because guess what I am? I don't think you should ever be scared of the person you love. Did I ever say that word? Sorry. Fear not. I'm going to start for the song. Hot Wings tells me she loves me, dog. That's big, man. None of the girls in the house told me this, man. Kind of got my heart dropping right now. You know, I want a woman that can be everything, man. I'm an all-around lover. And I'm really thinking Hot Wings is that type of woman. So you want to cut out of here and have a nightcap at my place? Good. This dinner actually went great, because I just feel like we're two peas in a pod, and we're meant to be together. And I complete him. Come on. <laughs> this is it. I'm the best girl for him. Like, if you want me, I'm there. I'm all yours. Take me, and you'll be a happy man. Welcome. This is nice. Sit down. We walk in, and there's rose petals all over the floor, and it's 
so romantic. Right. I'm getting weak. Man, you know the concerns that I had about Sassy Man are starting to fade away. And I'm starting to think that this woman could have the total package, man, and have everything that I'm looking for. What's in charge now? Um. <laughs> right now, I am no longer just Sassy. I am Mistress Sassy. <sighs> real, real, real. At this point, I'm not at all worried about Doll and Real's connection. Do I look like I'm playing? No. I'm silly. Mm. Me and Chance are just having a little makeout session, and it's fun. It has never been on this level. This right now is intense, and I am enjoying every minute of it. What's that? Mm. That was your stomach, not mine. Mm. <laughs> Hot wing stands right on the tip of my heart right now. You know what I mean? Running ahead of the pack, man, like a thoroughbred in heat. <laughs> Oh, that patrol, it's not sitting well in my stomach. It's not. Not like puking, just doesn't. A little gassy gas. Yeah. Yeah. Go on, walk through the bathroom. Burp, do whatever you got to do. <laughs> Last night was a great time, but a girl never kisses and tells. The glow of shade. <laughs> you have the glow. I don't have a glow. <laughs> I don't have a glow. You do have a glow. Look at that glow. Oh! <laughs> she shared my man's cootie. Bitch. <laughs> I can't control myself. My excitement. Oh, it was so funny last night. Oh, great. Here we go. So off the bed. <laughs> <laughs> I forget what I was doing. I was doing something. That you stay with my man. Whatever, you just... I can't let her get to me. I can't see how Real could see something positive in her like that. I can't contain myself. Man, we started off with 20 girls. Now we're down to four amazing ladies, man. This has been an incredible ride. This has been an incredible adventure. We gotta pick our stallionettes. We gotta pick the girls that we're gonna end up spending possibly the rest of our lives with. Man, Hot Wings was here for me from day one, you hear me? First day I laid eyes on that woman, we had a connection. I wanna like get to know you personally and spend time with you. You are so cute. Hot Wings, man, she's fine, she's beautiful, man, she's sexy, she's tough and fierce, she's hot-headed, she's spoiled, and she has a tendency to blow up at times, man. You obviously don't know me, I don't know who the I came from, you don't know who you're talking to. But you know what? I like Hot Wings because she's realistic about things. She don't sugarcoat nothing. Mama Sita, man, she's wild, crazy, and sexy. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> like that? Mama Sita flip flopped on me back in the day. You willing to keep it real with your boy? Yes. Mama Sita, why are you picking my brother? I guess she don't hear me no more. But once she came back to me, man, I always knew she was here for me and she was here to stay. I don't know what to do right now, man. I just don't know what to do. I got a tough decision I gotta make. I like Doll a lot and I like Sassy a lot. And my mind right now is just boggled and I don't know what the hell to do. This represents how uninhibited we could get if we got to know each other. It took her a while to step up, man. But when she opened up to me, she showed me that she can be more than a high maintenance woman. And you're beautiful no matter what. When you got makeup on or not, all right? I would still like to see the real eyes. That is when I started to feel a connection with her, man. Mm. Sassy man could be the real deal. I felt a little dissonant with Dawn at first. Can I get a hug? Mm. I wanted to get inside her head and wanted to know what was going on with Dawn. My mother and my dad passed away when I was younger. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. And she finally opened up to me and told me what it was. Then I realized Dawn is fresh and easy to be with. Mm -hmm. Fun. Well, you're 
tongue out. She's romantic. She's sexy. Can I ever give you a kiss for good luck? Mm. She's playful. This match is over. I gave you a good fight. I dig her a lot. Hell, they're both two beautiful women, and at this point in time, I don't know what the hell I want to do. Coming up. I wish I didn't have to make this decision because this is one that I don't want to make. Yeah, I have to pick someone, but I know someone's going to get hurt, too. Please do not tell me he's picking this lady. And later. I have a strong connection with the two of you ladies. Man, my stomach hurt, my head hurts. I don't know what to do right now. When it's staring you in your face, why are you questioning it? I don't know, man. Weather is just a sign. Whoever is picked tonight yeah. is meant to be. I think at this point, he should know. You can't keep fighting for something if someone's never going to get it. He should know. There's thunder and lightning, and that's exactly how my heart is feeling right now. I probably have met my one, my other half, you know? If I could dream, I would dream that I would go home with Chance. truly fallen for this man. I knew going into this that he was a great guy and he had all these wonderful qualities, but I did not expect to fall in love with him just like that. And really, I was falling and now I fell. And I hope he catches me. <laughs> going into elimination tonight, I have a lot of mixed feelings, you know? Like, yes, I'm 23. But on a soul level, I'm like a 29-year-old girl. Like, seriously, look at me. I'm mature, I sit back, I have grown conversations. But at the end of the day, I know what I want, and I want a family, I want kids, and I want real. And that's what I'm going for, so Sassy, back the hell up. You look very, very beautiful, all of you. And we tried to wait so you wouldn't be out here in the rain, but the fact of the matter is, the rain will not let up. Man, it is pouring outside, man. Are the gods crying because we have to eliminate somebody? I mean, I don't know. Man, I love this rain. You know why? Because I feel like this rain is symbolic, brother, of a relationship. Because sometimes a relationship is sunny, and sometimes it has a bad storm. And if we can weather through this, hell, then maybe we can weather through anything. I like that, Sam. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna let my brother do his thing. He's gonna go first. So I'm gonna go chill in the cup, bro. Sassy and Doll, I've connected with both of you, and both of you have touched me in so many different ways. And I wish I didn't have to make this decision because this is one that I don't want to make. Yeah, I have to pick someone, but I know someone's going to get hurt, too. Dolly, Dolly, Doll. You know what? I, I love your energy and your curiosity. You remind me of somebody that just wants to take on the world and... and, and Always on some new adventure. Your confidence shines like a brand new penny. I really do love that about you. I gave him my heart. This whole experience has been probably the wildest thing I've ever done. And I, I feel really special that I was able to meet Real and to be here still today and to go through these finals. And I hope that I do win his heart and we can be together. <sighs> Sassy, you know, from day one, you kind of, you put it out there. You have loosened up, and you have let your hair down. You took your contacts out because I wanted to see your beautiful eyes, and you showed them to me. At this point, I definitely know that I'm the better match for real. We connect on so many different levels. I know he would be very lucky to have me as his woman, and I'm hoping that he feels the same way about me that I do about him. Sassy, you are a very, very strong-minded woman. Took me a couple weeks to find that out. You are. Can you come down here? Real calls down Sassy, and I'm shocked. Like, please do not tell me he's picking this lady. I just want to be with him. I just want Real to be my man. Look, Hot Wings, I just worry with our relationship be filled with drama. What did you come here for? 
find love. All right, so when it's staring you in your face, why are you questioning it? Sassy, can you come down here? Real calls down Sassy and I'm shocked. I'm so disappointed right now that I'm breaking down in tears. I'm trying to hold my composure, but it's just so difficult. Last night, I was sitting there thinking like, where was this sassy the whole time we was in the house? Why didn't you show me this a long time ago? I had a hell of a time getting to know you, man. You are one beautiful girl. But I wish you would have spent more time showing me that side. I do too. So I won't be, I won't be picking you, sweetheart. I definitely thought that he was gonna choose me tonight. And the fact that he didn't, it just, it confuses me. You chose trash over treasure. Doll will never be able to hold a place in your heart like I will. Just know that you let go of a good woman and you can never have me back, ever. Doll, would you come down here, please? You know, I feel like you're the total package. Hell, we laugh together. Hell, we even wrestle together. And I still want my rematch. You're just, you're so young and vibrant and beautiful. You have so much ahead of you. And you can be that. Do you see me in your future? Of course. Good, because you know what? I definitely see you in mine. You know what, man? I feel like Doll's the best woman for me because we just have this all around amazing connection. I mean, we can have deep conversations, we can laugh, we can play. She's just an amazing freaking woman, and besides that, she is sexy as hell. Will you keep it real with your boy? Oh, come on. Why are you Will you keep it real with your boy? Like, oh, mm. mm. I'm ecstatic. I'm excited. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> like, I'm so happy. What else can I say? Come on, it's real. I'm so excited. He's wonderful, and I know we're going to be perfect together. <laughs> so Congratulations, you guys. Thank you. Congratulations, dog. Thank you, you guys are great together. If you guys don't mind, I'd like to get to my ceremony. All right. Oh, yeah, yeah. Man, my stomach hurt, my head hurt. I don't know what to do right now, man. Oh. I just don't know what to do. Look, Hot Wings, Mamacita, I have a strong connection with the two of you ladies. I mean, the connection is so strong, it's making my stomach hurt right now. At this point, I'm like stressing the funk out, because I'm like, I've been worrying this whole time, like, oh my God, it's between me and Hot Wings. But I hope that he remembers the connection him and I made so that he can make the right decision. Standing here, right here, right now, I honestly don't have any regrets. I feel like I did all I can. I feel like I've shown all I could show about myself. I said all I could say. He just has to make his choice. Real since Sassy Home, and I just feel like I know that I'm gonna have to stand through that same exact kind of scenario with Chance, and I don't know if I'm ready to handle it. <sighs> Look, Hot Wings, Mamacita, I have a strong connection with the two of you ladies. I mean, the connection is so strong, it's making my stomach hurt right now. I mean, with you, Mamacita, I always have a great time, you know what I mean? And in Hot Wings, when I'm with you, it feels like it's just me and you, you and me, and, and we have a blast, you know what I mean? But you know, even my parents were kind of worried that you can't handle a guy like me. That's what pulled me to you. That's who you are. And I told you last night, I said, Then why'd you try energy... to leave me more than once? Huh? And stuff like that. Why'd you try to leave me like more than once, like twice, three? I don't know, man. 
If I didn't talk you back, you wouldn't probably be standing here right now. I mean, I don't know. You think you got stamina to deal with me? I'm standing here. You know, I've been through hell and high water. I worked my little ass off to get this man. Challenges, girls, you know, everything. Just to get to this moment right here and just hear that I am the one. I just need to hear those words. Mamacita, you flip-flopped on me. And that's what made me really, really open my eye towards you. Ultimately, when you came back to me, I knew you came back to stay. You know what I mean? I got a question for you, Mama Cita. Do you think you have the stamina to go the distance with a guy like me? Are you really ready to be in a committed relationship? Of course, absolutely. That's what I'm here for. I am definitely ready for a relationship with someone like Chance. Like, I was ready from the first day I got here. Ah, <sighs> hot wings. You're definitely a girl I can settle down with. I just worry with our relationship be filled with drama. What did you come here for? Find love. All right, so when it's staring you in your face, why are you questioning it? I don't get it. Take it or leave it. It's right here. So what you saying, you love me? I told you that last night. I slipped up and said it, not even knowing that I meant to say it. I slipped up. When you accidentally say something, that's your heart saying how you feel. Without you even knowing you feel that way. I just feel like I'm the best choice and not Mama Sita because I love him. I haven't even hear, heard her say that she loved him. I love him. I deserve to win him. So you can take it or leave it. Make the leap as a man or walk away from it, but it's in your face. For once, I'm gonna take that. Come on down here. I can't, I, I always needed that passion and fire <laughs> from a woman like that. It's crazy to fall in love with someone and like, it's just such a good feeling. It makes you smile thinking about it. Like, you can't stop smiling. I don't know, it's just, I just love who he is and I wouldn't change him for the world, I wouldn't. <sighs> Mamacita. Man, I got mad love for you and so much love for you, and I wish you good luck. Thank you. And I'll always be your friend. Thank you. I feel the same way about both of you. I, I wish you both the best you. of luck ever. To be honest with you, I don't have any regrets about this experience. I can honestly tell you that I was ready to settle down with Chance, but you know, unfortunately, I just he's not the one for me, so. I'll be waiting around. I see you walking away from me. I just got to ask you something. Are you willing to take a chance with your biz oil? Yeah. <laughs> Can we get a Hey, wait, wait, wait. You know what? Can I'm we get some group love? I finally did it. Your boy picked somebody, <laughs> y'all. Your finally. boy picked somebody. And finally. you know what? She's so hot. She's so fun. And you look oh so good together, Ooh. I might add. Out of all the girls in the house, man, I ended up with Hot Wings. I finally found my stallion at y'all. I hope y'all happy, I'm happy, he's happy, I'm rest the road. This is a toast, dog. You know what? We finally found our stallion Cause we the what? Stallion Don't worry about it.